Ah, pup. I'm just gonna get out and walk. Okay, okay. leaving again. She's leaving us. I know, pups should go on vacation. She gotta go. Yeah, she's leaving. I know, mom gone. I know, it's so sad. What are we gonna do now? Well, it's 6 a.m. on a Saturday. Just me and the pups for a week now. Wow, this guy's mad. He's mad. Got beeps for mom. I don't know if it's gonna show up on the iPhone, but just cicadas everywhere flying. Good morning, YouTube. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. Lotus. Enzo. I know, she gone. She'll, she'll be back though. She'll be back. <coughs> Wifey is once again left us on vacation. You know, it, you need a vacation every other week. Anyways, the AC is broken, so that's gonna be atrocious. I just know it. It's a beautiful Saturday, so I'm going to do something that I don't normally do, and that is do something for myself. That's right. We're going pup free. Pup free. Gonna be pup free. It's gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay. Yeah. But don't worry. A little bit later, I am gonna take Enzo to the dog park, and Lotus will get plenty of attention and exercise today as well. Pups, make a note. We do not come back this way. It's not good. So this is being awesome though. Doing really well, pup. All right, buddy, we're gonna try this again, okay? We got sleepy. Let me get that. Okay. It don't smell that bad. You don't want to get this on your face. So, come here. How you feel? You feel good? You feel is it okay? Yeah, okay. Enzo, in. Gotta do baby brother now. So you gotta wait in the car, okay? All right, so for those of you unfamiliar, that is a T, or uh, T. That is a tick and flea preventative spray. Basically, to the smell and everything deters them. It's got like a lemon smell to it, so it doesn't smell bad. It's, it's strong, like I can smell it. Really? See, this is how we get the flea or ticks. But anyways, um, cause if you don't know, we don't use any type of flea or tick preventative. I don't like the idea of the poison and that there's too many, like, for us personally, the risks don't outweigh the reward. I know plenty of people that use them, family members included, that have no problems whatsoever. Uh, I would just rather, I would just rather do this, honestly. Come on, Lotus. No, don't need to, no, we don't need to actually test the spray. I mean, I can appreciate him wanting to be thorough, but no. You know, we were at this exact spot, not that many, I don't know, maybe a week or two ago. And you could see, like downtown. Now you can't see anything. I know. Can't see nothing. Where'd them views go? Got the views on views. Now, is views something that you chase? Yeah, I mean, I guess we do. Yeah, I, mean, I guess we do chase views. All right, so even though this was only a partial hike day, we went on a short hike. Now we're just kind of moseying around. We might get back on a trail again or something, I'm not sure. Several days ago, we went to the park, did not go on the trails, and Enzo came home with a tick. And it was because we were in a field similar to this, and he got too close to the edge. I remember him like sticking his head in, and that's how he had to have gotten it. So, unless I know like we're just going on like a massive field or something like that, pretty much gonna spray a little bit each time. No, it's not causing itches. You fib. You llama drama. You llama drama. And if you're interested in that anti-tick preventative spray, I'll link it below in the Amazon store. If you click on the Amazon store link, all the stuff that the pups use should be in there. And if it's not, just DM us and uh, I'll find it for you. Come on, boys. Let's get in before it gets too hot. Pups have decided that it's cooler to lay in the basement in front of the fan. I know, I believe you. We'll hang out down here today.
pump was that about? She was doing that for several minutes. When you're just too tired. Seriously. I'm out of control. We're gonna do it then. I was wondering where Lotus had gone off to. Are you allowed up there without your blanket? I just vacuumed that couch last night. I mean, don't you just look so comfy? You know, last week I didn't go to Cars and Coffee. I felt a little guilty leaving the pubs. I hadn't gotten to do anything yet that day. Plus, the weather wasn't that great. This week, not as guilty. They're gonna be fine. Carson Coffee. I plan to film basically nothing. Just kind of something to do for fun to relax. All right, I'm not filming anything at Carson Coffee, but this little Suzuki Samurai import, it's pretty cool. All right, so one of the things I've been wanting to do is work on socializing Enzo some more. He hasn't gotten a lot of practice with COVID and everything. Now that we're, you know, coming up to lesser restrictions and everything, I want to take him to the dog park. I wanna take Lotus around the dog park, not in it. Wifey's out of town right now. Been a minute since I left just a pup alone by themselves with no humans. Before we just head out and leave and see how he's gonna do, I think he'll do fine. What we're gonna do is we're gonna do a little test run. Basically, we're gonna act like we're leaving. I'm gonna load Enzo up, we're gonna drive down the street a little bit, and then I'm just gonna watch the cameras and see what Lotus actually does. So if we get to the end of the street and I'm watching the cameras and he's perfectly fine, he just like gets up on the couch and lays down, Oh my goodness. <laughs> then good, we'll go. It may be something where I gotta work with him a little bit, give him a, you know, start slow, basically. Maybe we just stay gone for five minutes and we come back. And then tomorrow we'll do it, we'll be gone for 10 minutes and then 15 and we'll work our way up. I'm not sure yet. I'm right, gonna do a little test run, Lotus. Well, it's foggy, but yeah, go on, get in. Okay, it's been about three or four minutes and he is sitting right in front of the couch. He went into the hallway where I can't see, but all the doors are shut and was there for about two minutes. I assume he was just laying down and then he went and looked out the front window again and now he's just sitting there. I was actually kind of hoping he'll just get on the couch or the bed and lay down, but he is definitely just sitting there. All right, we made it to the dog park. Had the camera up the whole time. Obviously, I can't watch when I'm driving, but I have it set to pop up if there's any motion. There hasn't been, which means he's still in the hallway. Probably really loud. I shut all the extra doors so that he would kind of be forced to go into a room where I have a camera pointing. And he was like, no, 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 I, I don't care about that. I'm just gonna hang out in the hallway, apparently. That's okay, I guess. I just wish I could see him. Oh my goodness, are you so excited? You so excited? And we could have parked in the special dog park spaces. What do you think of that? Thank you. Agitating. <laughs> you're fine. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Fine. I hate you. No, you're fine. She's a frisbee. Pick this up. What are you doing there, buddy? You making friends? You making any friends? Yeah. Oh, that's a good boy. That's a good boy. What's up, buddy? You making all kinds of friends? Yes, you're making the friends? Wait for me. Heel. Oh, good boy. That's a good boy. Wow, buddy, you are wiped out. He's already laying down. Uh, Lotus is on the staircase. Oh, you back up. 
you make a new friend there? Yeah, say so you make all kinds of friends. You're all independent and stuff. It's funny. He's he's all independent when we're in doll parks like that because because I just stand there. So he's like, well. If you're just gonna stand here, then I'm gonna mosey on. That's like the most independent you'll ever see him act. Yeah, have a good time. All right, I'll turn the AC on. All right, I've lost, lost track of Lotus, but Rally has clearly got a bug or something. She's having the time of her life. Oh my goodness, buddy. Oh, well, hi, Lotus. Hi. Hi. It's like, why do you smell like other pups? Well, hi, how did you do? Hey, what are you doing? You know, did you do all right? Yeah, you do okay? I mean, he's understandably a little angry, but otherwise, seems fine. We'll go get that birdie. <sighs> and he's moved on. Hi, buddy. We got the wipeouts. Lotus did a very, very thorough smell check of Enzo. Say, yeah, that's why we don't go to the park in the middle of the day. We stayed there almost 20 minutes, which is longer than I would normally stay when it's this warm. But yeah, say we're still tired, we're still hot. Yeah, it's gonna be a long time before we get that lunchy. And there's the dead spider that Rally was going after earlier, apparently. You did okay by yourself? Yeah, you love that dog park. I know, I know. Enzo had a blast. Um, so, wifey's always been a opposed to them after a traumatic event when he was six months old. So we've been kind of reluctant, but given that he's kind of picked up some bad habits from Lotus, I think it's time to visit them more. Plus he used to get some extra, like he gets, used to get to play with the neighbor dog more and some different things. He doesn't get that as often because of Lotus. So yeah, said so that baby brother and just ruined everything. Oh, you need a cupcake to feel better for yourself? Yeah. I've been able to get Lotus to take one bite of food, but I pull out the camera and suddenly he's all worked up, like, let me eat. Oh, you got the hunger now? All right, I noticed the back of the house is still all shady and cool, so we got the fan blowing in the cool air. And then meanwhile, I've closed off that entire portion of the house, so there's no air coming in from the sunny side. <laughs> I know, bub, I know. I'll be back soon-ish, six days. No, so hot. It's so hot. One fan, not enough. We need to go get a second one. So I'm gonna go get one, okay? It'll be all right. It'll be okay. Be okay. It's been a while since I've been out to sleep. <sighs> I wish I wasn't in a hurry because I just want to stay in here and enjoy the AC. Might as well pick up dinner while I'm out. Like, how late is this? Seriously. It's ridiculous for me. The heat's coming back, boys. It's coming back, I know. Well, we had three fans last night and it was still 80 degrees at midnight. Now we did have an AC unit that I bought when the AC broke a few weeks ago, but it sucked, so I took it back. And I wasn't gonna buy another one because it sucked. Thankfully, it's supposed to get fixed today. If it doesn't get fixed, I don't know what we're gonna do because even the basement, like I was like, well, we'll just sleep in the basement. Even the basement was hot because it's been broken for a few days. It's like, well, if we're gonna be hot, we might as well just surround ourselves with fans and do that. Anyways, all the names you see scrolling right now are all the Patreons that support us each and every month with their donations. I appreciate you all so much. If you are a Patreon member, make sure you check in with the Facebook group and the weekly live stream so that you can be a part of that. Otherwise, I appreciate you guys as always and we'll see you on the next one. Later. Yeah, and go in there and get some cool offs. Yeah, so I need to cool down. Go, go boy, go pee pee. You know, I used to do this stuff with him, but it's been well over a year since either one of them has really been left by themselves.